guest. Nice to meet y'all. This is Alicia <laughs> Gomez. <laughs> Gonzalez, what is it? Guadalupe. Guadalupe, my friend. We are both on our lunch together right now, which is... Double trouble. Yeah, I am tired. Like, I've been telling you guys the last few days I'm tired. I know I'm really tired. Like, I'm done. We're just She's... eating. She's done, too. She went um, Black, Black Friday, Friday shopping. shopping. And she was walking around and for hours, so... More than normal. Yeah. So we're just back here eating. Like always. She's eating a... Panini. That's a chicken caprice from Starbucks. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Mm hmm well, yeah. That's it. My friend, do you have any final words? <laughs> Help us. <laughs> Save us. Pay for us. <laughs> got out there my friend yeah but it's not that bad today for a Saturday usually it's like super busy so not bad for us being tired and being at work we will get through it yeah we're gonna be here till one o'clock so mm. yeah today's gonna be a long day but we'll see how it goes starting us off is who who we are to each other so she's gonna describe me and I'm gonna describe her so you go first you no you come on who you are to me what you're, can you describe like as me you're a person <laughs> well that's that's everyone we're all friends <laughs> you're someone who is loyal you don't you don't play around you, uh -huh. <laughs> you like to give motivational speeches, and um, <laughs> you're funny. Thanks. And you're crazy. Thanks. Okay. And then me describing her. Me, I'm okay. Me describing her. She's very open-hearted. She's funny. She's super stubborn, but it's so funny <laughs> to mess with her. Cause I'm, I'm a jokester. I like to mess around. That's I love. I feel like it's funny. It makes my life definitely interesting. I'm like an open book. I'm an open filter, I guess. And she's she has a big heart to me, and I've been holding her close to my heart. We late, lately have been getting closer. So right now, she's to me, she's she's very happy. She's a loving person. She has a big heart. Um, she is, like I said, stubborn. If she wants something, she wants it there, like now, <laughs> like today, not tomorrow. Um, but overall, she is a wonderful wonderful person to be around, for sure. Next question is where we are in life. Where are we in life? Well, in life, I am just turned 21, so that's a good thing. Right now, I'm working full time at um, a call center. I'm work there eight hours of the day. It's like I know in my last video I said it was like four to four to two. It was too early because it's actually five to two. <laughs> I just wake up at four, and um, I'm there full time. After that, after I get off at two, I just kind of do whatever I. I please and go about my day. Uh, me. <laughs> I am <Ooh. laughs> I am in high school. I am a freshman. And yeah, I don't have a lot of friends. I don't need a lot of friends. I have two friends. But um, I am a dancer also. I dance hip hop. <laughs> and that's it. Okay. Okay, next question. <laughs> I used to go to Zumba at the gym. Um... <laughs> Who are our idols? Like our celebrity idols? Oh, Beyonce. I love Beyonce. If you know me, 
And, um, you know, shout out to Dulce because she did take me to my first Beyonce concert. It was in 2016. She is the best person to go as far as concert. Well, it's my first concert, so I can't really give like a <laughs> 1 to 10 scale. But I can say that it was definitely the best concert I've been to. Um, it was the whole night, like, had me on my toes. I was singing Lost My Voice the next day. I sung her song on the way to L.A. because that's where it was at. And um, on my way back. So my voice was just play screaming because, you know, seeing her, getting to see her firsthand in front of me instead of on a screen or a TV or even an iPod or phone. It was definitely um, exciting. So I have her, her wristband still. It's a green wristband. I also have her shirt. I purchased her shirt when I went to the concert. Um, and my friend actually that took me, she ended up throwing up. And I was like, whoa, like, are you excited? Like, what's going on? Are you okay? Like, Mika, are you okay? Like, are you feeling good? And so I was like very... Um, She's my idol for sure. Somebody I listened to for a long time since I was little. I love how she is as a person. She has a husband, has been with him for like ever. Yeah, literally since she was, she has three kids. She, what a coincidence, had twins, had one baby, then her second was twins. So she's definitely for me my idol. Um, I look up to her a lot and I love the way, I love her vibe. I love her music. I love singing in general. So that's definitely my idol. My idol. <laughs> I love Demi the Bottom. I like, cause, the way she is, she motivates people a lot, and she's just beautiful, and she has a voice, like... Maybe next time. <laughs> okay, um... Oh, why are we going... Like, why did we start going to the gym together? Oh, we started... How me and her started getting closer, we actually started going to the gym um, together as, like, trying to motivate each other, because I feel when you're going as a team or, um, you know, with someone else, it's definitely motivational, because... When you feel lazy and you feel like I'm not doing this today, like it's not happening, then you got that other person that's like, we're gonna do it. Yeah, like they're the, they're the motivator, and you know it's just not you in these shoes, and it's not just you trying to get fit. So it's definitely like a battle that you face when you work out. Um, it's mind over matter. So that for sure, always trust and believed in. So I feel her as my partner, her being my sister. Her being someone I live with, it makes it easier to be healthy, to start working out as a team and grow a bond with her. So that's something that me and her have done together. And I love it. Me and her share stories. We'll crack jokes at the gym, <laughs> literally about ourselves. And that's us. We're a fun time for sure. Okay. Um... All right, I'm going to skip a question. <laughs> oh. Right, right? <laughs> yeah, I don't get it. <laughs> Let me see. It's about our motivation in life. Oh, we already said that. Yeah. Oh, yeah, never mind. <laughs> um, <laughs> who do we look up to in our family? Mom, I want to say my mom. She's, I could feel like I've, my mom. like I've, I'm, I'm the middle child, so I've seen her go from like the oldest to the youngest. And just seeing her grow and, sh and her just going through the, the loss of my father and even being there to experience it and watching the struggle happen, mm -hmm. it was definitely something that was touching. And I, she's the strongest woman I know. And she's like, oh, I, uh, I could say even though me, me and her don't really, we bump heads here and there. We don't, we don't always agree. She's definitely my number one fan, I could say. She's my, I love her so much, she's my mom. So she's definitely my idol in my home, in my life. She's the one I strive for. She's the one that keeps me going, so... It's, she's mine. I love her. She's the cutest person I've ever met. <laughs> she's just, I love her. She, we go everywhere together. They're like twins. Yeah. Like out of all the siblings, them two is just, oh, my mom, she used to say it's in Spanish. Um, it's mi chicle. Like oh, she yeah. basically would say that my sister her. is her gum, yeah. like stays stuck to her butt. Yeah. And I used to think that was funny, but like, it, was, it was true for sure. Like as seeing her grow. My sister's always, like, been stuck, but she's a baby, and she's the baby girl, so that's, you know, mom and mom, mm -hmm. definitely, I would get why. It's, I still, to this day, I'm her cheek, like, because I'll see her leave, and I'll call her right away, where are you going? Um, she won't even make it out the door, <laughs> like, I swear. Where are you going? Um, I'm leaving, um, can I go? I'm, I'm, I'm putting my shoes on, Kirby. <laughs> it's just how I am, I love her, she's everything to me. Yeah, but thank you guys for, um, watching the video, I do appreciate it. My Hold name on. is Monica. One more question. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, why, did, why, why did we want to join the channel all together? Oh, YouTube. Why did we want to all start YouTube? I can't speak for the girls. Yeah. They can, but I can only speak for myself. I can say I joined YouTube because I thought it was fun. I feel my life is interesting. Sometimes I sit back and I hit the bench. I always tell myself, you. what I mean by that is like kind of recollect yourself, have that time at least once, you know, 
every day at least once time in your day to sit back and recollect your feelings and your mind and I feel like when I do that I look back on like what I did and conquered through the day and even in in a week I'm like literally I got a video tape this like people would die like people can relate people can disagree people can have their own feelings towards it everybody does people will always talk whether you're doing good or bad so I just feel like my life my family we're interesting we're a loving family we're jokesters so that's definitely like a I feel like along the way we'll get comfortable being on camera and I feel like you guys will see what we see. So that, that I could say that's why I joined. It was something that I feel like my life is interesting. I love, you know, knowing I'm a very open person. So I love being open and talking to people. That's something I'm not going to be that person that like if you say hi to me and I don't know you, I'll be like, oh, hey, you know, like I'm not going to sit there and like roll my eyes and I'll like, keep walking. Like that's so stuck up to me. So I honestly like the fact of being open with people and kind of explaining myself to others as far as like I know I'm not the only one going through life itself and going through stuff so I can I kind of want to flip the script and, and just show you guys that everybody is human even the idols the famous people um they all go they all, go, they all have their cup of tea they all have their own little life and struggle that they go through so I feel like mine I feel like it's very my family's an open book so I could say that that's my non-sugar coating we're an open book um, for me, I just think it'll. I just think it'll be a really good experience to like have. It'll be really fun, especially because all of the sisters, we're a really big family, <laughs> and it's mostly our girls. So I just think it'll be fun to like show you guys our lives and what we do in a day, because like we're not always together. That's it. That's it. That's, it. <laughs> That's what I meant, right? <laughs> Thank you guys for staying, staying tuned. My name's Monica. My name's Anna. And see you guys later. Hasta la vista. Bye. Thank you.